wrestling fans. Today is Saturday, September 28th, 2024. I am Lance Brock. Thank you everyone for tuning in to the Saturday episode of 360 Good Morning Wrestling Fans. And Saturday night, it's all right for fighting. Tonight, the second part of Grand Slam 2024 with AEW Saturday Collision tonight. Not a live episode, but tonight Collision was taped Wednesday night right after Dynamite from Arthur Ashe Stadium in New York. And we are also one week away next Saturday, the WWE Bad Blood Premium Live event live from Atlanta as we get ready for that. But on this Saturday episode, without any further ado or wasting any more time, Let's talk about tonight's AEW Collision Grand Slam. Like I have already said, taped episode tonight from Arthur Ashe Stadium in New York. The AEW Continental Championship will be an eliminator match. Not on the line, but this is an eliminator match that AEW Continental Champion Kazuchika Okada will be taking on one half of the Ring of Honor World Tag Team Champions Sammy Guevara as he is on his quest to try to be Sammy two belts as he said I think this will be a good match, and I could kind of see them having Sammy beat Okada tonight, since this is an eliminator, and then maybe at Russell Dream, have him go on to face Okada again. With the championship on the line. But we will just have to wait and see. But I could kind of see them letting Guevara get the win tonight in this Eliminator match. We will also have a trios match. The AEW... And the titles are on the line. The AEW World Trios Championships. The Blackpool Combat Club. Pack Claudio Castagnoli. And Wheeler Yuta. Who we did not see Wednesday night on Dynamite Grand Slam. Will be taking on Private Party and Commander. I'm sure that will be a pretty good, exciting, high-flying match. But I'm sure the BCC will end up retaining the trio's titles in this one. And next we have the Learning Tree, Chris Jericho, Big Bill, and the Bad Apple, Keith Lee, will be taking on... The Ring of Honor World Champion Mark Briscoe, freshly squeezed Orange Cassidy, and Kyle O'Reilly. And actually, this just isn't a trios match. This is a tornado trios match taking place tonight on Collision Grand Slam. And we will have the in-ring return of Jamie Hayter taking on Soraya 
and it is a Soraya's Rules match, which Harley Cameron explained the rules to us on Collision last week, where the rules, of course, pretty much benefit Soraya. I believe said no cheating unless you are Soraya. No outside interference unless you are a friend of Soraya. So, of course, stacking the odds on the side of Soraya. But I'm sure these two will still end up having a really good match. Soraya and Jamie Hayter. And they might think of a way where Jamie Hayter can still kind of rally in this one and get the win and defeat Soraya. We have, will have a three-way Lucha Libre, the Beast Mortos, Hologram, and Jerustico. Been a while since we have seen Jerustico on any AEW television as of late. That should be uh, talking about high flying, exciting matches like earlier. That should definitely be one right there. Looking forward to that. And we will also have a lumberjack strap match. Jeff Jarrett taking on Hangman Adam Page. This one has been going back since the Owen Hart Foundation Cup Tournament. Looking forward to this one. I'm sure these two will have a good match. And the Lumberjacks, of course, are going to be AEW wrestlers out there with straps. And if you remember, back in the day, TNA a match that they've done I think maybe twice was the fans revenge match where they had fans outside of the ring with straps as the lumberjacks. I believe the first one was Jeff Jarrett and Samoa Joe and they quickly learned that to better pick some of the fans they use in that kind of match because I think some of the fans got a little out of hand with the straps. Really, when you think about it, that's not too big of a surprise that something like that would happen. And the TNT champion Jack Perry, the scapegoat, has an open challenge tonight definitely be interesting to see who his opponent is. Of course I do not know because like I always say I do not read spoilers so as of right now I have no idea what happened Wednesday night at Arthur Ashe Stadium but I'm sure if it was a really big name that would have gotten out online And somehow I probably accidentally would have been spoiled for tonight. But luckily, right now I do not know anything that will be taking place tonight on Collision Grand Slam. And that is all for this Saturday episode of 360 Good Morning Wrestling Fans. Once again, I just want to thank everyone for tuning in and listening. I appreciate everyone listening. In the comment section, you can go there right now and leave your thoughts and your opinions on last night's episodes of WWE Friday Night Smackdown and AEW Rampage. Hope everyone has a great rest of your Saturday and hope everyone enjoys Collision Grand Slam tonight. I will be back tomorrow 
for the Saturday episode, or the Sunday episode, excuse me, of Good Morning Wrestling Fans. I hope everyone listening right now will join me once again. Also, before I go, I almost forgot to mention Box of Mania from High Spots. You can watch it on High Spots Facebook page at 5 p.m. Eastern today. I've talked about Box of Mania before. You buy a number. And you watch to see what you get. But unfortunately, if you did not order a box, it is too late now. All sold out. But you can still watch the live stream on facebook.com slash high spots. And then maybe next box of mania, you can get a number and get a good prize. But like I said, I will talk to everyone tomorrow. But until then, have a great pro wrestling day.